What is up, everyone? We are back again with another YouTube video. This is a Roblox one, and in this video, we'll be showing you how to download and install Roblox and how to download and install Discord on your PC. So, in order to do Roblox, we'll do that first. You go into Roblox.com and you first need to create a profile. So, we'll log out real quick. And uh, this is what you'll see. So you have to enter your month, your birthday, month, day, year. I recommend doing an age that gives you, that makes you over 18 because, or over 13 at the minimum, but over 18, that way you don't get any limitations. You'll type in your username in this section and then you'll make yourself a little password here. And um, then your gender, gender. It's optional though, so you don't have to put that. And then you click sign up, so you do that. Or if you already have a pre-existing account, you click log in. And then you'll have to type in your name and password minus autofills and log in. All right. So once you do that, you'll go in, you'll see a profile that looks something like this. You'll have your little profile in the middle, all your friends, games you recently played and all that fun stuff. Now, in order to actually download Roblox itself, you have to go into a game. So let's just go into this game and then we'll press play and it'll say Roblox is loading. Get ready to play. Up, oh, da, 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 for an app. Uh, down and delete that. That's just for the MacBook users. Um, you'll see this. You'll have to press download and install Roblox. So then a little thing will appear in the bottom of your browser. You click that and it'll open it. See, it'll say opening. Now, for Windows users, it might be slightly different. It might be a little different process, but it's pretty self explanatory. You got the installer. Double click that. Yes, open. It may say it's sketchy, but as long as you do it from the official Roblox site, you'll be fine. Configuring Roblox. Uh, don't say that. And the loading screen of Doom. Oh no. Oh, oh. We're back here again. Oh, Roblox is successfully installed. Click the play button to join any game. All right. That's it. So that is that concludes our segment on how to download and install Roblox. So uh, that's that. I'm just going to show you a few things about Roblox real quick. So once you go in, you'll have this. When you're in games, you will have to. You can press the escape button, and then a list of all the people in game will show up, and you can add friends that way through your name. Or on the home, you have your profile. So here's your profile. It shows your name, a little thing about your person, and then all your stuff that you're wearing, and all your friends, and stuff you own, and then any groups you're in. So that's some stuff there. Um, you can also link your Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and Twitch accounts to it. So there's that. Um, then you go to friends. On the left side, you have your current friends, your follower, following pe people that you're following, and your followers, and then people that requested. So, yep, we got that. And then uh, avatar, this is how you can customize your avatar. You have all the recent stuff you have. You have clothing, so you can do hat, hair, face, neck, soldiers, all that fun stuff. A lot of stuff costs Robux, which is like in-game currency, but if you need that, you can get it. If not, you'll be fine. Like everything I'm wearing now, this is like the entire outfit costs like two Robux. So it's not that hard to get stuff that looks decent. Um, yeah, body, you can change the way you look. Animations, costumes, yeah. Um, that's, that's a rundown of outfits so you basically just click on the thing you want to wear like that see you could just mess it all up you know make it whatever the heck you want and then it might take a while to load or if you have a pre-existing outfit it'll show up like that and you can click that and then yep there's the outfit so yep that's that for Roblox that concludes our segment on a rundown of the basic things you can do on Roblox um, next, we will be doing Discord. So, Discord has a web browser and an application you can install. I can recommend the application because it works more efficiently and is just more easier to use. And it doesn't take up space on your browser. It's just a separate thing. So, you go discord.com slash channels at me, blah, blah, blah. So, it'll actually, no, no, no. Discord.com that. And then you will press uh, download. So, uh, depending on what computers say, it'll download for Windows or Mac. So you can press download for whatever it is or open your browser. I recommend doing it for downloading it. So you download that. 
you go, wait for that to load, click it, it'll say opening Discord, then you have this, so you just move down to applications, just do that, and it'll move that in there, and then it should begin to open. So yeah, if you're on, if you see right here, it has the download button. So if this doesn't immediately show up, you can just click it here on the top left. All right, so that's downloading. And then here it is on my dock, just appeared there. So I can click that and it'll begin to open. Discord is apt to download from the internet. Yes, okay. So here it is. This is uh, my Discord. So it has all your stuff. So I'm going to sign out and sign in real quick. So uh, it's down here. In the bottom. All right. So yeah, log out. So you'll get this. It'll say blah, blah, blah. Here we are. You'll type in your email or phone number or password to log in. Or if you don't have an account, you'll have register. So you'll type in an email, make a username, password, and then your date of birth. Again, I recommend putting 18. That we don't have any limitations on your account, but if you want, it, but if you don't want to lie about your age, that's fine too. So you fill that stuff in, or if you already have an account, you can sign it. And uh, yeah, that's that's a rundown of Discord. So let me log into this real quick. All right, so we log back in. So we have on the left side are all your channels that you can join. And on if you press the home button up top, it'll show your friends. So you have all the friends online, all pending, blocked, or add friends. So to add a friend, you'll type in their username, which shows up in their on the, their profile area down here. It's the username, so mine's captain. Then number, hashtag 7299. So in order to, if you wanted to find me, you'd type in captain, hashtag, 7299. Now, if you do try to friend me, I probably will not accept it because you have to either share a server with me or I actually have to know you. So I don't recommend adding me randomly. But that's how you do that. And you'll press send friend request. And then it'll show up in pending. And you can just add people there. And then if you want to talk to them, they'll show up on your direct messages. Or you could just click them in friends list here. And you could just click on them and then be like, hi, what's up? And just type stuff. All right, so that's that. Then for servers, if you want to join a server, you'll have to get an invite link. So let's say for this server you wanted to join it, you could get. Let's say I gave you the link, and then I pasted it in my browser. Then it'll show up here, and I'll say Discord at launch. Continue to Discord. So if you have the app, it'll show up. If not, it'll show up in the browser. Press continue to Discord, and then it'll take you right to that um, server. See? There we go. So that's the app. That's the one in the browser, but instead it'll take you onto this. Or if you want, you could just go to the bottom, press add server, and then let's say, or sorry, not add, join server. Right. No, no, it is add server. Already have an invite, join a server. And then you take, paste the link there and you can join it that way. So that's how you join servers. And uh, yeah, so if there's any questions about anything here, anything you didn't understand, just uh, let me know and I'll be more.